that's going to be too close now. No, we can always lean back. Hello. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Spring Chintzia. Welcome back channel. to the channel. Welcome back to the blue zone. This, this wasn't is, planned. No, this is a light blue time. I actually have my light blue scrunchie with me The one today. I lost. No, that's turquoise. Um, the one I got in Miami, the satin. You know what else I've lost? What? All of my jewellery. I, li oh my god, look at this room, do you like? <gasps> oh wow, that's stunning. Yeah, you have to go to that shop in Nottingham. Oh. <laughs> um, right. And they have some really nice other ones like this. I'm going to go and get some more and stack them. Oh. They're like Art Deco ones. Was it that place where you took me up that road? Yes. Oh. Yeah, because I think I might have left them in London. Do you I, do you I've lost seeing them in the room. No, because I've lost all my under the stories rings as well. These are the only rings I have. I, I've lost. You know all those ones I bought. In yeah, London? lost. I bought another signet ring. I don't even know. And because I've, I've lost my S necklace as what? well. What? Because I know. What the fuck? It was my S necklace, my S ring from Adina's jewellery. These were those two little ones, yeah. like all the ones which I was wearing. You wear the S necklace. All I the can't time. find them anywhere. They have disappeared. Where have we been? Well, the last place I remember having them is London, but I remember packing them away. But I can't find them. Oh shit, yeah, of course we stayed the night, didn't we? Two nights. Two nights? Oh, goodness me. So I'm gonna have to order them all again, but I don't want to do that. Because what if I find them? I don't do it all. Yeah, so it's whole time. It's whole time. It's all so. Awesome. so it's getting colder here. I may have my legs out today. I'm but quite hot right now. I think yeah. it's these lights. Yeah. I'm not used to it, are we? <laughs> I'm not but, used to it in here. <laughs> um, it's getting colder it and is. it's coat season. I'm nice. happy it's getting colder. Me too. I was like, when I could put my coat on, I was like, get in. Although this put morning, this coat on. I was a bit out cold. Coats. Because I, had, I didn't have my coat on, even yeah. though I do have new coats. <laughs> I just didn't have the coat on. <gasps> because yesterday it was really hot. In England? Yeah, it was quite hot. I said it was 24 degrees. What did I do yesterday? Oh yeah, the sun was out yeah. yesterday. They had the door open in the nail shop. Oh nice, I need to go look how But I had look that, I had that man. Oh my god, oh. Look at this. Do you want to, look how long my nails, I'm sorry if this makes people be sick. Look how long my nails are underneath. Is that absolutely vile or what? It's absolutely disgusting. Ew! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> look how long. It's absolutely disgusting. Uh, I am dying to go to the nail. I think I'm, I'm yeah, going after this. I don't like that. No, me neither. I had that. I had this new boy and try and avoid him because he's shit. <laughs> <laughs> I've had the one who doesn't wear that, no, Yeah, no, I had oh, him. I had yeah. him. And then he was like soaking up on polish. And I was like, oh, please, I need someone to swap. Like, please leave. Why was he And new? then they always sort of like change they around, always, don't they? Honestly, you sit there, you go through four different yeah. people. So he got up and I was like, thank fuck. And then this girl came and I was like, great, I like you done before. Yeah. So then she did it, but then the man who was painting them, this new boy came and I was like, who the fuck is this? And he was painting them. It honestly was causing me such frustration. Why? I can't even tell you. So first of all, imagine oh. if I'm the man and you're her. He kept doing this to my arm. Oh like my that. God. <laughs> Literally what kept the yes, fuck? And then when, he was, when he was painting my nail, he wasn't like, Swiping yeah. down, he was dotting it, what the fuck? and I was literally like there little... looking at him like, "Oh my god, just drag oh, it!" It was so frustrating. He was like doing dots, not not just normal nail no. varnish. I have this one sometimes, and he's really annoying. He 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 takes so long because that's he's such a perfectionist, yeah. and I appreciate that. But then I'm like, "You're a professional, just do it a bit quicker." Yeah, and like it'll be fine. My nails will be fine. He'll have filed them. They will be fine. I'm ready to leave. And, and it's he's like, like, he's looking again. And he's like, and then he and then he gets something. I'm like, "What is wrong? What is wrong? There's nothing wrong." I and know. he files it again. And, he, and then he's like this. Yeah. I'm like, they look absolutely fine to me. It's absolutely fine. And, and he's filing. He's like, he just he doesn't do big, long strokes. He's no, he doesn't. Little what? He's like this. Yeah. So quick. How do you describe it? He's like, short, jagged I've tried movements. to film it before, but it didn't capture. Yeah, it wouldn't and have And it looks silly, yeah. but I really tried to capture it. Anyway. Anyway, this is our first autumn haul. Expect a lot. This isn't all the autumn clothes. I'm still trying to figure out my autumn style. Me too. I'm still honing it in. Me too. It's still because I still want to wear like big jumpers and bare legs. But I know, I know in uh, maybe three weeks' time that is not going to be. I sustainable. think this. I've got a feeling that this this autumn style is just going to be all about different coats. 
and it's going to be a lot of the similar stuff underneath the coats but it's going to be different I'm coats. I'm feeling a lot of denim i yeah. want some different denim yeah and also lots of different trainers yeah it's gonna be i feel like it's gonna be accessories like bags shoes and coats i feel like yeah do you and see that bag there yeah it's beautiful I found it in my summer months old everyone go look at your mum's old bags that she used to use in the 90s i've got this gorgeous little i'll show you this gorgeous little nude i don't think my bag's famous got it i literally was like you know what i want like a little shoulder bag i was like look to the thing she's like you can't have that i'm like you haven't used this in 20 years <laughs> And then she finally gave it, she's like, that's my bag. And um, if you have that bag, then I need one of your bags. I'm like, you don't even use it, it's not fair. But yeah, how cute. That's really cute. And yeah, so she used to use this when, it's Fiorelli, it's very old, but I thought, this I is I can't perfect. remember her with that bag. I think I but kind of can. But it's a very mum bag, It was it? when she was going through, um, she went through like a very different phase. It's trying to fashion-y phase. fashion -y phase. Like when she was probably about 30. Yeah, 30. Quite youthful, actually. Yeah. Granted, not all of this is warmth. There is a few bits which... Me too. Probably aren't really appropriate, but you need to see. I've got something which I might wear on Saturday, but I haven't tried it on yet. Oh, I have two things that I might wear on Saturday. Also, I have a black House of CB blazer coming to your house, not my house. Oh, that's here. Oh. Because I, I got it and I was like... Yeah, because I asked her for things. And she's like, yeah, Sophia, that's great. Yes. And I was like... Thank you, Chitsia. <laughs> Signed off Chitsia. She's like, brilliant, Sophia. I'll get that sent straight away. And I was like, <laughs> I saw that. And then I went on the website and she's wearing it for cycling shorts. Yeah. Did you see what Courtney wore the other day to the Beyonce concert? This is what I'm going to ah, do. Ah, you're going to wear it open with a brown I'm going to do it. I'm going to do big black blazer, short black, black bra. I don't have a black bra though, so I might have to do it a nude. I think you should order a black. Okay. Yeah, I do. So black bra, Otherwise, black cycling shorts. Like, you've got a bra on. Black's yeah, a bit true. more light. That's a top. I hope it's big enough. It looked huge. Okay, good. I, what size did I get? Then no, no, I didn't look. I just held it up and I was like, that's not right. I put it back in the box. So yeah, that's my... Vi I have, well, I have three options for the weekend, which you will see. I tried on something. Sorry. I tried yeah, on something. Sorry. But it was small and it was too big. Too weighty around the bottom. And I was like, it's just... I have that. to try it on again. The one in white? That. No, so I, have I have got that. And I, I might like wear that. Quite weighty around the bottom. Uh, From like one angle, it looks like it's like flaring out. Yeah, well, that's another one I've got. Not that oh, one. Oh, well, that one for me does that. It's what size? Small. But it like Strange. flares out. So if I'm stood still, it's like. Mm. Uh, I have to one. be like. That's like the one. Have, have to be to like leg stretch. Yeah, that's like looked. the one that's in there. Yeah, I know what you mean. Right, should we commence? Yeah. Oh, I'm exhausted already. There are two things from Zara that I did forget to bring. So there will be the next one. I've got something from Misguided, and I went on Misguided last night. And Misguided I ordered, has. I have some good things from Misguided. I ordered a coat and a pair of snakeskin trousers. Oh my god! Right, so fun. but I ordered the snakeskin trousers first. Left my order, signed out, checked out, whatever. Then I went back on the website again and found the coat. Found the coat. And the coats arrived, but the trousers haven't. And I ordered the trousers like an hour first. earlier than the coat. Interesting. But, and they're gorgeous. I was really looking forward to having them. They're I, my favourite piece. They look dark snakeskin brown. They look gorgeous. I have seen some floating around Instagram. Yeah, snakeskin I think they pair. That's quite a big thing right now, I feel like. Okay. okay, let's get started. So, I'm going to start with maybe... I don't even know if they've seen this. Have they seen this? Mm, no, oh, you so. have the... this? Oh, no. no I didn't vlog this. Of course not. Okay, so this is a men's jumper that is one of my favourites right now. Um, men's Adidas, however, I got it in Urban Outfitters in the men's section. And I just absolutely love it. It's like this. Oh, that's nice. I've worn it on my Instagram. It's just got these sleeves and you can wear it as a dress. I got size large. See, what do we do about this in the winter? How can we wear these as dresses? I don't, I don't know. know if we can, can we? Right now we can do it with trainers and stuff. But yeah, so I love it. It's just big and baggy. You get the gist. And it's... I like it. Sometimes I wear it to the gym. So what's lounging that? about large, and it's a men's. Urban Outfitters. Urban Outfitters. But it might be on Adidas website. But I think it's just. I don't think it is because I went on Adidas website this morning. Oh, well then hopefully I'll be able to find a link to it. Check I like it, it. And again, you know, I wear this into winter. See, I think we can wear jumper dresses with coats. Yeah. But not in like December. I'm talking now. But however, when you wear a jumper dress and you put your arms in a coat, not it lifts up. It it's, does, yeah. It's, it's even not this, the same. this is like a shirt dress, put the coat on, I was like, the fuck? It lifts up. It was up. like, and yeah. then it just ruins it's it. It's under the arms, So it's isn't like, it? can't wear a coat with this. All that, really. Mm. 
Okay, um, my first thing is actually from Zara, and I got this oh when I was God. in Scotland. So oh it's God. this cropped denim white jacket, almost a bit like cord, but cord not. Cord. And then on the inside, it's like got that Sherpa fleecy that. lining. That's delicious. So I just thought it was really cute. Um, yeah, I saw it and I was like, yeah, I okay, I think I'm going to get that. Uh, so I think I'll just probably wear this with jeans and like a top underneath There's it. A similar one on Boohoo, I saw this one. I think I saw that as well. Very similar. Yeah. I'll link that below. Borg. It was, yeah, Borg. it was very it was, similar. It was, it was what, and I, um, I picked it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this is Zara, and I really like it. Um, if you're going to order it online, I wouldn't worry about the sizes, because I tried on the size extra small, small, medium. I couldn't tell the difference. <laughs> I thought like, these all look the same. If yeah. anything, just the medium, the sleeves were a bit wider and it yeah. was a bit wider on the back. So if a size is out of stock and you want to order it and you're varying, there was not much difference between the ones that I tried on. But Zara, huge fan. You have to love. wear it though. I've had it for about a week now and yeah. I haven't worn it yet. Cropped ones are quite hard to work with. I wasn't in the mood for a crop no. jacket. You've got to be. Because it's quite a commitment. Do you hear that noise? Yeah, someone in the home. Mum? Yeah. Oh my, oh my god. god. That was a delayed <laughs> response. That was a delay. I literally thought, turn off the camera right now. I'm just going to be quiet. Oh. oh. Um, so yeah, that's that. I love it down that. there. Uh, next up, I'm going to show... Okay, I'll show this. This, now, this probably hasn't been washed in... Well, it's, <laughs> it's, at, very it's actually not been washed once. <laughs> I've worn this on two long haul flights. Oh now. no. I've also wore this around. It probably smells quite bad. However, this is a ma men's Urban Outfitters jumper. Urban Outfitters. Okay. Are we slanted? No, I think we're alright. I think we're slanted. Oh, well, everyone can just. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this camera is really hot. This is starting to sweat. Okay, that's much better. But I'll work off oh. a bit now. Oh, my box. Just gonna have to dip down that one to see all my tip. <sighs> That's fine, should we just budge back like that? Scooch back. There we go. So, this jumper again is Men's Urban Outfitters. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. <laughs> USA. It USA. Says, USA. USA Champions. That used to be white, did it not? Yes. Has it's your mum washed that with a grey something or black? Probably. Um, but again, this is size large and I can wear it as a jumper dress. Again, jumper dress with trainers is the... Yeah, is the vibe. It, a big baggy thing with trainers is the vibe for now before it gets too cold. Too cold. Whilst we can. But yeah, I love this and I'm pretty sure they have it. I have the t-shirt version you do. in black. It says NYC, doesn't it? It says NYC, but it's a similar thing. But yeah, me honestly, go down to Men's Urban. And have a look, it's Much absolutely better. fantastic. Women's Urban is shit, we don't even look in that anymore. No, I didn't. I went in when I was in Edinburgh, I didn't even look at women's, no. went straight upstairs to the men's. Granted, I didn't find anything. <laughs> Granted, I didn't did. find anything. <laughs> But I didn't even look at no, it because I thought, what's the their point? Their t-shirts are so much better, their yeah. hoodies, jumpers are so much better. And they're bigger, I like it. Unless yeah. you want it fitted like the women's. Then. Oh, sorry. Oh, something in my eye. Okay. Next are Ooh, these trainers. Very nice. Falcons, Falcons. Falcons. So these are the same ones as Chintia's got, the Adidas Falcons, but different colours. Very nice. These are slightly more Gray. muted colours. Muted. Than, they've got a pink sole than like the bright green yeah, and I'm orange. And, mine. Yeah. yeah well, I just thought these were more me. I feel like yeah. I would get more wear out of these and I really like them. They now just have a nice, white. Yeah, I've just got white trainers already. Yeah, me too, I know. And I just think they're nice when you just, with denim jeans and you just want a bit of colour and you don't white just want trainers. a white trainer on. Because I feel like I've worn a lot of just white trainers. Um, so yeah. I'm so into trainers right now, it's unreal. And I got these from ASOS. ASOS have them all. And they, they had all the sizes, they weren't hard to find, they weren't out of stock. Every single size yeah. was there. They have the Adidas Youngs in all black now. Oh. I made purchase. I've really wanted those black um, Yeezys with the nude stripe. The, remember yes. the old ones? Yes. I asked yes. how much they were from the Instagram guy. Guess what he a said? Lot. Like 700. 720. Yeah. So I said, because they're so rare. Yeah. I asked him for the um, Yeezy blush and he said, they're going to be maybe about a grand to source because they're so rare. I was like, oh, I'm sure we used to be able to get those. On. Yeah, exactly. But the blush colour, I wanted the blush. Um, so I've got black. I was like, oh, oh no, blush. Blush. The blush was so nice. So See the new hair. Yes, I ordered them. Oh, listen to my story. I ordered them on Easy Supply. 
I was so excited mm. about the release. So I was like, yes, quick, quick, order them. Wait. What, which new release are you talking about? The triple about? Y. Oh, right, okay. So, and, and because there was a lot of them, I didn't have to... Anyway, it was American sizing. And I knew that I, in women's, am a... In America, women's size 8 as a woman. So size 8 America women is size 5. So I did all that. And then literally yesterday, oh I looked at my confirmation email. And I was like, oh, I just have an inkling that this isn't the right fucking size. So I looked it up, and I was correct. Size 8 is size 5. However, on easy supply, doing? it's men's size. So size 8 is actually a size 10. So oh, I've ordered a size, no. size 10 Yeezys. So don't know what I'm going to do with those when they arrive. What size is Lewis? An 11. They'll probably fit him. Christian's ordered those. But again, it's like, well, it's about two hundred. How much did you pay? Yeah, uh, $220. I ordered the socks as well, but oh. so the socks are coming. Ah. A nude pair, a white pair, and a black pair. It says Calabasas. Ooh. They're only $15, so I popped them in my basket. I'm talking about the other pair, which are like, um, the green and then... Multi-stripe. With the, the colour, the colour. Well, I asked the Instagram man, 700, 700 not 700, sorry. I think about 500, and I was like, they're very rare. Just don't want to pay that. Just don't want to pay that. Anyway, so yeah. these are ASOS. Great love purchase. Them, love them. And true to size, they are, yeah, size okay, six. Okay, next up, we're going to go on to, so as a variation to an oversized jumper, I'm now on to oversized shirts. Oh, I thought you were going to say t-shirts. So Misguided have all these, they have this in denim, black, and a nude. I'm going to get the nude. Ooh, now it's like camel. Nude sounds nice. Because I wanted to, because when I was ordering it, I was like, I don't want to order all three just in case I don't fucking like it. Yeah. But I do. So this is a big oversized, you know? Can you see? Shirt. Shirt. And it's so comfy. I feel like I'm about to go paint. Yeah. You look very arty. Yeah, I like it with the trainers. Like art studio. Yeah, I feel like that. I, yeah. I quite like it. Mm. Like Miss Bedford. Yeah. Got Who? these on. Art oh, teacher. She used to wear like Don't denims, that I feel like. Oh. Miss oh, she was A-level. Sorry about that. You should know. So yeah, this with like a little bag. This is very much my vibe. Yep, I like that. And this is misguided, very inexpensive. I don't think it was much. But yeah, they also have a camel and I will link that below because I'm going to buy that now also. And then I have a black, which I really, Ooh, really like. I like the black. I'm planning on doing the black with some black trainers. Yep, I like for that. Like a darker vibe. Yeah. But again, it's just I might order that actually. Uh, Sophia, I think you should because the model the model was actually wearing the black one with a pair of denim denim jeans and trainers and it looked oh. sick it looked and she had it big she had this big and down with the denim like mom jeans on and a pair of trainers and, like a cute little bag and it looked really nice so i like the sound of that yeah me too so i'm gonna see how that goes but i am gonna order even then you could even wear that open if you felt like it exactly and they, they are cute open and size eight don't size up because they're fucking massive that's they're huge they're meant to be oversized honestly probably doesn't really matter what size you get they're still going to be fucking massive. Size 8. Look like how big it is. Look how big. Look, look at all that space. Okay, next, um, I have a skirt. Now, this is from House of CB, and they, this is their new yes. loungewear range. And I highly recommend you take a look because it's from the gorgeous. So this is one of the skirts from there, and it's got these slits Gosh. either side. Now, when I got this, I was thinking, like, when I wear this, is it going to be flapping when I walk? Flapping. But it doesn't. Because it's such a heavy knit, right? Because it's heavy yeah. and it just doesn't do that for some reason. But it's a really beautiful colour. Obviously, it's really good quality because it's House of CB. And um, it's lovely. This is a size extra small and I got the matching jumper, which if you go on the website, you will see like the co-ord. And that's also extra small, but that's a bit too small. Very weird. It's... Oh, it's just it's not too small but it's like if I was going to wear that style of top I would want it to just hang yeah. a bit more so I would be tempted to get the medium in the top if I was going to wear it because I can't really wear the extra small because I just feel like it looks too too like to try, try hard, hard because it's tight you yeah. went big and banging like I wanted big it to really thing. like fall off me so I look quite not like effortless yeah well, but I really before. like this skirt I think it's a nice variation to like the I love it. jersey midi so skirts different. you know and if you don't want to wear jeans one day and it's still wintry because it's that knit yeah. and it's okay for now because they are there are slits either side so it's not like it's the warmest yeah, thing in the yeah, world yeah. so I'm going to try and wear it now whilst I still can because very nice yeah absolutely delicious. but I think with a nice long coat you know even if it does get a bit cold I feel like you can still get away with yeah. it 
100%. So next up is another misguided thing. I, honestly, Ooh, this misguided. I'm really enjoying Overprint Little Thing right now. Yeah, me too. They I have went some on really nice. And I find some nice bits. Yeah, found. I find some nice bits. Nice bits. <laughs> and so this is like a this is a jumpsuit. However, it looks a bit boiler suity, but it's satin. Ooh. Is that and it's it's this satin. What a beautiful colour! I know. Is it look? At, I want on my nails next. I think. But mm. yeah, and it just goes straight down. I think it's, it comes with a belt. Um, but I don't well, know it's where got that's belt gone. Loop. Got belt loop. Um, and it's got buttons up, and then the trousers are really nice and just like straight. Like they're, they're not too t Like the last thing you want is this material to be skin tight. Tight. This is not, not very unfor no, not very, not very flattering. No. So yeah, this is delicious. I got this in a size ten, so it won't be too big. Okay. And again, I might wear this with my uh, leopard print belt. Some lovely pair of heels would look really even, nice. Even even in the daytime, like I feel like I could wear this with a pair of white trainers yeah. and like a denim jacket. Cash it down. Cash it down. But yeah. I thought it was a great piece. A again, not too warm, but with a big fluffy coat, I feel like it would do fine. Yeah. Speaking of jumpsuits, now that this is, is one I have from Zara. I almost, but I saw it in Mexico. It was in Mexico. I haven't worn it yet. Oh, interesting. Because I feel like I want to wear it with a heel. A heel. Because I tried it on with trainers, and I was like. It's just not living up to its full potential with trainers. Yeah, I it looks. I feel like it's gonna look a lot better with heels. So I that's about. Yet. That's like one other thing I have. Yeah. So this is the jumpsuit. I it love comes this with one. a belt, so it's really nice and flattering because you can pull it in at the waist, and it's like trousers. So the zips that go up to there, like the trouser, then the rest of it is like a shirt. So it's got like buttons on there, so you can button it up gorgeous. whether you want it really high or really low and um, it's really nice it's nice and silky Slowly. it's not silky but it's a really soft material yeah. I don't really know how to describe it's not like it. really tough boiler suit material no you know, like all those other boiler suits are like proper denim yeah this isn't it's really quite light yeah this is lovely um so i do really like it and i really like the color but i'm just yet to wear it but i do want to wear it i just need to wear should it should we insert a picture of miss jocelyn wearing it yeah because she looked gorgeous she looked great she's it. why i bought it because i saw it on her and i was like yeah I insert pick so this is the Visualization. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just need to wear it with heels. But then I'm like, I don't really want to wear it on a night out because it's not really a night You're out. You'll stain like a bitch. I know. Right? I just need to find somewhere to wear it. Yeah. You'll figure it out. So yeah, that's Zara, and I've got size small. Next up is this. Now this is a very. It's not a. Oh yeah, that's definitely what you're gonna buy. You know. <laughs> I saw this and I instantly thought, what do you think of when you see wow. this? Wow. What do you think of when you see this? Your mum's cagoule. I feel like Thank she's got you. a cuckoo just she like that. She does have a blue cuckoo like this, however that was an insult. <laughs> what do you think? Uh, who has worn something similar to this? Come on. Kim! To this the fashion, blue. She, the blue she's worn this literally, they've literally copied what she wore. Oh. I think it would might have been an off white I think piece. I saw this on Misguided in brown uh, and I was going to order it but I thought, is that weird? I don't know. Yeah. It's a dress. It's a play suit, oh, so however it looks dress. like a little dress. I actually really like that. Right, I'm going to insert the picture of Kim wearing the thing. Right? This is what... So when I saw it, I was like, oh, that's what they've tried to do. Got you. And it looks really cool. I want it I in, like I that. I want it in like I white. really like that. It, honestly, it's the most flattering thing. And I might wear it tomorrow night with heels. I was just going to say that. You yeah. can wear that on a night out. I have to wear this with heels. It yeah. looks weird in the day. Like It, it has to be like a statement night out piece. Yes. Um, but yeah, I love it. It comes in at the waist. I really it's a bit like booby. that. It's booby. You can decide the thing. And the zips are a bit weird and cool, like a bit odd, a bit weird. Bit interesting. But yeah, I think they do have it in another colour, but I want it in like white and nude. I want it in white like would black be nice. as well. Because yeah. it's super flattering. And it's like a. What is that material? Thanks, Andrew. Fair break. Oh, oops. Hello? Oof. Yeah, so, have you, do you, can you recall the picture of Kim? No. Right, let me show you, because, um, this, I really like it. Like, I wouldn't buy it. I really like it, I think it's cool. I wouldn't buy it unless, okay, Kim you Kardashian blue yeah. dress, this might be it. Mm. Here it is. Ah, oh, of course. Do you remember? Yeah, I like oh it. Oh my god, it is actually, I didn't realise it was literally so much just of a copy. That is what 
And I believe um, Pretty Little Thing have done a copy of it also. Maybe I saw it on Pretty Little Thing, so I'm, I'm picturing the Pretty Little Thing model in it. Umar's girlfriend was wearing it oh. to that thing you might have seen. But yeah, she looks so cool in it with heels. And I was just like, look. It does need to be worn with heels. 100%. I think, it? But yeah, that was my. So I might wear that this weekend with a pair of nude heels. Yeah, I like that. But yeah, cool. And again, that was size 10, I believe. I don't think I got an 8 because I wanted it to be. Okay, next is this dress from O'Polly, which that is not autumn. I'm not sure about it. You see, I, I love, love it, but it looks like some sort of underwear lingerie yeah. situation. You have to do. I feel like when I wore a similar one like this, do you remember, I, you have to wear a denim jacket. This, but I don't want to ruin it. I know, denim jacket. I know. This looks like oh, some sort of lingerie delicious. slip dress. You're going to see in it. But it's so stunning it's beautiful it's, it's like got these sheer panels at the side this is gorgeous Feel it's that. gorgeous I know. isn't it i haven't tried it on yet but i just oh, i'm dying to wear it that's why i ordered it i had no nights out planned gorgeous. but i was like i need to have but this in my wardrobe but again these cups are beautiful beautiful aren't they Absolutely. and have you let me show you the model in it because that's what sold me on it i was like you know what i don't care what it looks like Whoa, i need to it's own such this good quality these I know. straps let me show you. So I was going to wear that the weekend, but I thought, yeah. I'm just going to look like I forgot to put my actual well, dress on. a blueberry and uh, <laughs> a lingerie model. But what jacket am I supposed to wear with that? You need like a gorgeous, thick, beautiful denim jacket that we don't own. We don't own. Unless I find some sort of shirt that I could wear over it. Yes. Have a look. I don't want to ruin it, no, you know. I know. But let me show you what the model looks like because she just looked phenomenal and I was like, I need to, I need to Could have this. Could get itchy like, on my wrist? You sure? Maybe you should go to the doctor. Like, look. This one bit is just like raw. Moisturised. Yeah. Maybe you've got dry skin. Yeah. It's alright this, folks. Oh, I'm all of a phone break as well. <laughs> Where is it? Now, this annoys me because now I can't find it because it should be before these. Have you seen this on there? Uh, because I, I wanted to order this for the weekend. However, it's not been released yet. This. Um, this pink one. Ooh, I like that. Just so like, ch -ch, mm. you know, pink. Right, it's not on the website anymore, which means everyone else must have bought it, so I'm clearly not the only one that wants to wear it on yeah, a night out. Absolutely Let me correct. try and find it on the Opoly website because the Try girl... and find it on the Instagram. That's what I'm that's what I meant. That's, that's what, what, you what mean. I meant, yeah. yeah. That's what you mean. The girl looks gorgeous <laughs> in it and on her I was like, that looks totally fine. Totally that doesn't fine. look like, you know, like oh I think it's just because it's on you. Yeah. You know, it's when you wear different things like oh shit. Okay, this is her in oh, so, white. Oh. Mm, I'm gonna wear that on my wedding night. I know. Um, I know exactly what model you're talking about. Okay, here's a video. <gasps> yeah. Delicious. See, it, it does look a bit like that's your underwear. It's but it's raunchy. also it's a raunchy. It's also just a gorgeous Colour. dress. I love the, the colour. The colour is like yellowy, yes. um, champagne-y nude. I like, almost wish it was just all just this silky. Uh, then maybe it would be less much. Yeah. yeah but I, I'm going to try it on and see how I feel. Yeah. Um, I do like. But I maybe think it's lovely. Maybe you could do... I trying to think of like a jacket, Carmen. Hmm, I'll go back to you on that one. Yeah. Okay, next up is this now oh me too coincidence we both own the same coat <laughs> this was not planned this i was, was not planned i walked in with it she went oh shit i've also got that also so, so it's honestly it's fantastic how much was it about 60 50 nine i think no more than 60. oh i've still got the tag uh, on mine doesn't say the price it does on those things Oh, we've got, spare button. We've both got size eight. Fantastic. This fits really yeah, nicely. It's not too big. No. Now, I have that House of CB one and it's fucking massive on me. It drowns me out. And what I, size did you get? I got medium because it was the only one available at the time. <laughs> and too desperate. I was desperate for it. That's why I was like, fuck, I just need it. I have to get medium. 
And I literally can't wear it, so that yeah. was a silly mistake. Yeah. I, what I've learned with coats is that you really need to keep it small. You do. I think for some reason, when we were all younger, we all used to think size up with a coat so you can fit stuff underneath yes, it. Yes, but... That used to be my mentality, but yeah. now I'm like, you know what? If anything with a coat, it'll miss size down. Otherwise, yeah. especially with the long ones, otherwise they just look too big and yeah. it looks a bit silly. Yeah. So I think, yeah, definitely don't size up. No, but this is gorge. This is a fit, lovely, a beautiful you colour. Like a pink, just delicious. Marshmallow. You know, cuddly thing. Yeah. And it's, it's, like, just, it's like those Care Bears. Care Bears? I was just about to say, what's that bear from um, Toy Story 3 that smells? The evil one? This is what it reminds uh, me of. I don't know what they are called. Mariana has a uh, bear of it and he used to smell of strawberries. Yeah, they do smell strawberries. So that's what it reminds me of. But it's just a nice variation to like a camel. Yes. I thought it was really nice because I've got three coats which you are yet to see which are all essentially the same they're all like a brown teddy brown and i thought teddy. you know what i'm gonna look the same all winter if i don't yeah. get a different yeah. color coat yeah. that's why i thought this was really nice and these coats long coats look really nice with jeans jeans nice trainers socks just something simple yeah. underneath it that's why i think nice bag yeah. this will look nice with these actually oh my god yeah that little pink accent little pink Great. Yeah, this is misguided. I, I, last night, I ordered this last night and they still had all the sizes left. So I would hurry up with this one if I were you. Listen, you already got it as well. I saw she that. She did. That's why I got it. Oh, it really? It looked good on her and I was like, you yes. convinced me. I'm yeah. going to do that. Okay, next up is um, just something quite basic. But when I was doing my misguided order, I was looking at, you know, the last oh, minute I've got things. This. And I thought, yeah, I'll throw that in for £6 yeah. or £5 I or whatever it was. So I'm thinking, just a little V. Just a little V white And it's tea. a tight one, and, and I like that, you know, get in the hands to rate the breasts. Yeah, that's a good you one. Yeah, with a nice lace bra. It's quite see-through, you have to Is wear white, white or nude. Yet. Yeah, right. Well, well it looks nice, yeah. Right now. So yeah, I'm thinking this jeans, a coat, and I'd like this in black, yeah. and I would like some other variations of this, please. please. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Okay, next And that was size Is eight. Okay, I've actually got a pair of jeans. Now these are from Misguided, and these are a high-waisted, like Have extreme. Worn these yet? I wore these in a picture. There's my picture, waist. Yes, right. Okay. Haven't worn them out, out and about. So these are an extremely wide leg jean. I saw them on the model. They look much wider than her. They do. Like they do. on the model, I was like, oh. they do. But I tried them on, and they fit really nicely around the waist. Mm. Like they fit because I got size eight. And I was like, great, these actually fit really right. well. And but yeah, I don't They're know if lovely. I like I don't know if I like the look of them with trainers because they are such a wide leg. Because they go to the floor. So it would just be poking out. Yeah, yeah, I feel like I wanna wear them with just a clear heel, yeah. a clear perspex yeah. heel and like a nice little top. I wore them with this top, which is from House of CB. I was gonna bring that, but I just thought it's, that's not autumn appropriate. Wait, it's not autumn appropriate. But I wore them with that and that looked really nice. Yeah, cute. This is hard to see, but it's on my Instagram. It's like a cute little corset, corset thing. Corset Victorian villager top. Yeah. And it looks really it's nice. It's very with villager. The jeans. It's very I, I tried to write in Mexico, but I thought, you know what, I'm gonna get some looks because fashion is not. <laughs> no, yeah. So I really like these jeans, but I'm just a bit, because I can't wear them with the long coat because it's just the, that's too much. Lot. So, so I'm, I'm thinking, just... if this would have looked cute in summer with sliders. I know. You can't bring sliders. out sliders. Sliders with your toes. And just a little, your little Yeah, that's v probably what I needed. Yeah. But anyway, they are a really nice jean. They're a really nice colour of blue. This is the colour of blue that I like yes. on jeans. Delicious. And they're not too wide, but they are just more for heels, I think. Yeah. That would look really big. Why don't you wear at the weekend? With what nice. top? So, yeah, okay, next can. up is my other option for the night out. Basically, do you remember? Oh, did you get this? Yes, I find. Oh, I've seen this all over. So I basic, love this. Have you seen Kylie in the camel yes, one? Yeah, that has yeah. been sold out since she wore it. Yeah. And I'm fuming. However, they just released the black and literally as soon as it came out, I got it. So it's just beautiful. I've not tried it on yet. However, I, I think it's going to be all right. Oh. <laughs> I think. Oh, it's very fucking bit tight there. Oh, not much stretch in that, not is much there? I got size small because I thought, anyway. Anyway, it's like a ruched. Stunning. And it's got like some um, it's got piping Halloween here. Costume. It could, couldn't it? Put a witch's hat on. Mm. And it's just literally straight down to the floor. It smells nice. And maybe it smells like new cast man. Yeah. Yeah. Should we insert the picture of Kylie wearing the camel one so you can see the vision? And so this is the black version. Yeah, and Beautiful. I really enjoy it. I think yeah. it's quite a showstopper. 
Hundred percent. You know, hundred percent. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, next, I'm going to show you this coat. So this is you've probably seen this before. This is the House of CB coat, which this is the one that I have for too large. Now I got the size extra small, and it's perfect, <gasps> but it's still you. big. It's fucking massive. And I'm like, imagine wow. what the medium is yeah. like. <laughs> so this is basically a big brown teddy coat Oops. and it's got a nice like belt at the back same yes. material nice color it's very yours is very heavy. heavy um nice yeah buttons just very big they also have it in nude they do they have it in like a blush pink blush yeah blush but pink. nice just to wear with denim jeans i've got one very similar very similar now but this is asos and i thought do i need this those? is sold out probably now. not is it yeah i'm pretty sure Forgot when I did, and I had this because Naomi had this, yeah. And she put it on her store. I was like, Naomi, I'm I saw when that. Naomi put it on her store and thought that's gonna go. And I swiped up straight away and bought it. See, I didn't, and I regret it because uh, I thought I'm not sure if this is me, but I can always send it, it back. She put it up like a month ago, and I was like, I don't need that yet. It's yeah, fine. I can see, wait, I and it's it. sold out. It. Um, are you sure it's sold out? I'm pretty well. I looked for Teddy Tote Coat on no. ASUS and it wasn't there because on my 21 buttons this morning, I typed in Teddy Coat and it was the first oh. one. I but 21 incorrect. buttons doesn't it doesn't take into account stock, stock does it? doesn't at all. But anyway, if this isn't out of stock, this is from ASOS, and this is I think I prefer this to the House of CB one. I agree because it's slightly lighter. This is more similar to tell, the um, kind of. misguided. Yeah, it is. This is literally the same fit, the same shape as yeah. the pink misguided one, and I just prefer. I've just wore whenever I got the choice, I've gone for this one. Yeah. So I think that's sort of I prefer this one. Yeah. I don't know why because they're both really nice. But yeah, just a really nice long teddy coat. Yeah, I didn't wear stuff like this last year, so I think it's time to this year. I didn't have any long coats. You know coats. they brought back the puffer, which we wore in New York, we were obsessed with. And I thought, no. God, move on. Move on. We're over that. See, that's why I thought this year, I thought everyone's wearing teddy coats again. Yeah. That's why I thought I'm going to go for long coats. Who remembers the puffer we were obsessed over that Sophia was trying to get in nude? I got it in nude. And then she was fighting, fighting, fighting to get it in nude. Grey. Grey, grey, grey. Tried to I sold that on Depop a long time ago. I sold mine on Depop a long time ago. But now they've bought it back. <gasps> oh my god. So last night I was looking for the Christian Aguilera pants on PRT. Right. Not on there anymore. Issue. But I typed in on Google. They're called Chap. Right. Leather Chaps, they're called. That's the right. style where it's like, no, no it's just a trouser leg. Right. And then it was like, pretty little thing. And I clicked on it and it was the picture of the girl in them. But they're all sold so, out. Um, and then I typed in on Depop and I couldn't find them, but someone had a wanted thing, like wanted, and they put a picture of them up. Mm. So I did it on mine, see if anyone had them. Because they're all sold out, so someone must own them. I need to sort out my Jasmine. Well then I Like another, right now when he saw it out. I had another idea because then I went on Google and I was like, right, I need to try and find these and I just couldn't find any like good ones. Good ones. They were all like they were on there, but they were like all black or like sequin, like oh. not the colours that I needed. No. And then I was talking to Alfie, and he said, why don't you go to Paris Hilton? So I could get like a Juicy Couture tracksuit track and then a little bag with a dog in it oh and a little God. mobile phone and some that. sunglasses. But I don't know if people think I'm Barbie. No, I think Paris Hilton. I think if you had the glasses, blusher, yeah. pink lips, juicy. Barbie doesn't wear juicy. She'd, but it's just a pink tracksuit. But get a juicy one. Yeah, I will, yeah. Get a real and little key and heels. Yeah. Like those little. So that's my other option. Do you remember those little white ones you wore with those They're trousers? They're still in my bedroom. I should fucking wear them. <laughs> she doesn't even know you've got them. Um, um, so yeah, I could wear that. Yeah, that's a good idea. But I don't know if I want to. I don't know. Interesting. Well, Anywho. next up is a coat from Boohoo. Now this is kind of like my chuck this on when you're going to the supermarket, chuck this on when you're going to the gym, chuck this on. It's late at night, chuck it on. I went to the cinema and I watched um, I'm going to, A yeah. Simple Favour. You need to watch it. What's Everyone it needs to watch right, it. Thanks. Blake Lively's in it. Oh, I've seen the ad. And it's so good. Yeah. It's so good. It's so like, where is this film going? There's yeah. so many twists and turns and it's really good. I'd watch it again. Amazing. Yeah, I see I'm good. Okay. Yeah, I will go at the weekend. Mm -hmm. So this is a boohoo coat. It's great. Oh, I've got this in mint. In mint, however, on the website it's called Sage. Oh, Sage, yeah. This is size 8. It's big. These are fluorescent things. It covers the bum. It's warm. It's cosy. And like I'm thinking on a winter's night when I need to run out and get some bread. You know? Someone's calling. Oh, God. All these calls. Hello. I'm just at Sophia's store. We're still filming. I'll be going. I'll meet you soon. 
you're going gym? Okay, yeah. Bye. Lydia's already been to the gym today. I'm going to be like half an hour. Yeah, okay, bye, bye, bye. Yeah, she finished school at like 12. I saw her on fire my friends. Interesting. Also, I have something to tell you about, I'll tell you after. About what? About how we can all save our lives if we ever get kidnapped. So let's finish the haul and then I'll tell you the stories. Who's being kidnapped? I watched the video. It's just about, it's literally going to save your life if you ever get kidnapped. Let's do the haul. And then everyone's on the edge of their seat waiting I think I'm finished. Oh. oh, I have this top from Zara. Oh, nice. No, not my usual go-to, but I just saw it and I was like, you know what, I'm going to get it. That with your teddy though, right? And it was just a turtleneck, quite corporate, but it's got no sleeves. Sleeves, And I just thought that's going to look really nice, just even with jeans, a coat. Because yeah. I was struggling. I was like, I don't have any tops. I don't own any tops. I've got jumpers. I've got like oversized t-shirts. But when you want to wear something under a coat... It's hard if it's oversized, like you were saying earlier. So I got a top like this, just because I thought it would, I don't know, I just thought it was a nice I thing. I like that. And it's from Zara, yeah. so, and it's nice knitted, it's quite yeah. a nice material. Um, so yeah, I think that's everything. Okay, so... Oh, let me show you my snakeskin trousers, which aren't here yet. You keep going. Oh yeah, I'll describe the two things I got from Zara. It was like a, an off-white suede trench coat. It was gorgeous. And it was only like £50. I saw a trench coat last night like, and I was going to order it, but I thought... I thought it was going to be like 100, 200 pounds, like Zara. Literally 50 pounds, well, it was really good. Wow. Right, they haven't sent these yet, ready for dispatch. Right, interesting. I paid for next day delivery and they're not here yet. Well, that is... Yeah, my um, premium class thing every day is run out and he's buy it again for the whole year. Do they still uh, have it? It's run out, I'm misguided. Brown snakeskin print. Yeah, so my story, basically I watched this video about this girl and she was kidnapped, right? And raped. And it was about how she saved herself. This is so sick. If she didn't do this, she would have been killed. Just quick interlude. Right. They're not on the website anymore for some reason. I can't find them. But on my order history, it says that they, they are called Brown Snake Print Shiny Wide Leg. Actually, my dress is on there. I can't show you that. No, I don't. But they're a beautiful wide leg snake print trouser and they're £35. So Absolutely. if I get them, I will let you know if they're any good. Okay, so this girl, it was in America. She was, it was about 10 o'clock at night. She was leaving a um, supermarket. She had a carrier bags, walk into a car, um, gets to a car. Guy comes up behind her with a knife, being like, get in the car, get in the passenger seat, give me your keys. So obviously, he's got a knife. You know, no one's around. So she climbs over, gets in her... So this is her own car. Oh She's God. in the passenger seat of her own car. This man gets in her driver's seat and starts driving, right? At this point, she's like, shit. He takes her phone, everything, okay? Oh, my God. So this man is driving, right? He drives to this car park quite far out. I think they were driving for about half an hour, which is obviously shitting herself. You know, he has a weapon. He gets to this car park and she, he rapes her, right? Oh, my God. In the car. But, no, it's got a good ending. So he rapes her in the car and then the man is like, right, um, I, I'm going to take you to this place. Like, I'm going to like, basically, like he was kidnapping her and he was going to use her as like a like, sex slave or whatever. Um, and he was like, I don't know where it is. Um, can you, I need to use your phone to like get on the, like on Google Maps to see. She was like, okay, if you give me my phone, um, I will f help you get to this place and I'll get it up on Google Maps and I'll direct you. And he's like, okay, so that was their compromise, right? So she goes on her phone, and this is what saved her life. She, so, I never knew this existed. Did you know you can share your location on iMessage? No. So she went on her message with her boyfriend really quickly. You click the I button here. So here's my messages with here. You click the I button here, and you click send my current location. So look, if I click that, it sent you my location. So she said, wow. look, my location, look, Chintzy's location. So, oh, I can't show you that because obviously that's her location. But she sent her location to her boyfriend and her boyfriend was asleep because, but he has a certain sound for her. It's a different sound. And something told him like, wake up, like you need to look at this notification. And obviously she was in Atlanta. He drove her really far um, from where, and he was like, what the fuck? Like, why the fuck? So she sent everyone send your location oh my god yeah so she just did that really quick and then she was able to send have a few messages with her boyfriend he was like where are you she's like kidnapped like come get me like etc and then a, a boyfriend obviously knew her location got the police saved her wow 
I had no idea. Neither did I. Like, literally, she was explaining it, and I was like, oh, I was absolutely mind blown. Wow, that's a good tip for us all. If we need to share our location. But even just like on nights out, I'm just going to share my location, just like all the time. Yeah. It's absolutely fantastic. Loads even you if probably you're know in, it exists. It's like what you can do on Uber, isn't it? Share yeah. your location, share your ride. But isn't that amazing? Like, he knew exactly where she was. Yeah. I think it's fantastic. That's amazing. It literally saved her life. We could use that in a lot of situations. Oh my god, I know. I was, I, I, honestly, I felt like, oh my god, wow, I didn't even know. Yeah, that's really good. Okay, well, so um, we've learned things today and we've seen lots of lovely clothes. So everything's going to be linked down below. This was just, even though it wasn't all autumn stuff, it's, it's kind of we're getting start. there. We're getting I there. I feel like the next one will be like, this is what we're wearing this winter or autumn. Yes. Yes. It will be like what? Because right now I feel like we're still sort of transitioning. Like we're still having hot days I've here still and there. Got my bare legs and out. I'm a bit like I don't know what to do. Yeah. So but I feel like yeah, in a few weeks I feel like we'll be into the coldness yes. and we can really go yes. for it. Um so yeah, if anyone's got any autumn garms that you think we need, please let oh, us know. I, please. You always send me some nice bits. Yeah. I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, let me just spend my money. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching everybody. Um we love you lots. We will see you in a few days and mm. kiss kiss. Bye bye. That's about it. <laughs>